Hello there. I don't know if you've uh, come across U Gears. Um, they're a Ukraine-based company who do these amazing laser-cut uh, models that you can make. And this is a gift to me. It's a hurdy-gurdy. And I'm afraid I've already started. <laughs> it's making progress. You know, you can spin around a bit, isn't it? Right. What do I want to say about it? Because I mean, there, are, there are build videos out there, and there's you know time lapse of people building it and all that sort of thing. But I just thought, just to let you know, these models are probably worth the price. They're expensive. I think this one's about fifty quid. Um, but they're beautifully made, and the instructions are beautifully laid out. No language, you know, just pictures, very clearly telling you what to do next. They even uh, provide you with tools. I mean, the, the first thing you do is build this little thing. I think partly because it will, you know, kind of get you used to how it works. And uh, you can see the instructions. And it's a little hammer for bashing things together. Um, very clever. All the parts are numbered very clearly. And they also give you this little tool <laughs> for pressing out bits. You can see how slow it is to take these out. But it's, you've just got to take your time. I'm not guaranteeing I'll have no breakages. Oh. Guarantee you will if you, if you don't take your time. Exclamation mark. Do get it the right way around. Let's clean it up around like that. There we go. Okay, no. Little dotted lines like that. Just, you know, that's the centre you're going on. Because you could try and pop it on there. I mean, it wouldn't really work, but there'd be other occasions perhaps where it would more likely work. Right, over another page. We are <clears throat> about a quarter of the way through. Two, three, four. I notice it's saying two, three, four. So the V, I don't really notice this, but these boards aren't currently. Yeah, and that's four. <laughs> two, two, three, and four. Boom. So we know that we're going to find our parts on there, which is good. I'd say I have not found a single error in this model so far. I don't know if you can see that, but again, I've got a notch on that, so it's going to catch in there and just neatly hold itself together. Uh -huh. Increase that point, I presume, is a shaft. Basically, candle wax is an old carpenter's trick. Making drawers slide smooth. Mm. <laughs> right, let's get some grease on that. There were only a couple of times that I thought, oh my goodness, am I going to be able to manage this? And that's with this component here, 76, and the same thing with 77, where, as you can see, it's a sort of angled piece, and there's sort of, you're only expected to put one end of it in, and to get that, which is deliberately made hard to insert, 
to actually stay to, to go in enough um, and again here uh, really tough so here it is finished <laughs> it's a bit squeaky <laughs> that's not how you're supposed to play it you're supposed to play it on your lap and I'm, I'm not a great player but you can hear a professional making it sound just as squeaky if you like if you click on that link <laughs> But it's just a lot of fun, and um, oh, <laughs> I can't help but point out these pointless gears inside, in the guts, right in there. Totally pointless, but a lot of fun, and uh, yeah, I'd recommend these kits. Well, certainly this one, it's brilliant. See you next time.